Hey guys, it is Arika Misha and today I'll be doing an updated video um, I did on my channel. Oh my goodness, I must have done this video three years ago, maybe even longer. That's how much I needed to update this video. Um, today I will be showing you guys, as you guys can see, all my ingredients. I will be showing you guys how I make my caramel frappe at home um, versus, because I used to be addicted to the McDonald's. Well, I must admit, I, I still love McDonald's caramel frappe. If you've ever had one, then you'd understand my addiction. They are so good. I used to go to McDonald's all the time to get the caramel frappe every week. Yes. They are so good. Anyway, so I was spending all that money every week, sometimes twice a week, sometimes three times. Okay, we're not, we not getting into all of that. We're not getting it. That's not what we're here for. Okay, so uh, once again, this is Arika Misha. Um, I am here to show you guys my updated at-home caramel frappe uh, video. I'm doing an updated video. Um, I did this video on my channel years ago. The video is still doing great. Years later, that video is still making high numbers for me. I appreciate everyone for your love and support on my channel. But I did need to come and do an updated video, you know, because that video is old. So let's get into it let me show you guys um you know and, and you know starbucks got they, their caramel frappe as well i've had that too but i like mcdonald's caramel frappe better than i like starbucks hey right, that's just me you know y'all if you have both then you can compare them but anyway so let's get into it today because i don't want to make this a really long video um okay so i got my neutral bullet video uh my neutral bullet um blender over here um, I have some salted caramel Dunkin Donut salted caramel um, coffee creamer Dunkin Donuts this is the salted caramel all right I have the Torani classic caramel syrup Torani classic caramel syrup and I have the cafe Bustello espresso style coffee yes sweetened i got the sweetened one uh -uh, i need my sugar i don't know about y'all but i need my sugar anyway so yes that's the coffee we'll be using today to give us that coffee flavor so and i have here four ice cubes yes four ice cubes and i have my aesthetically pleasing glass yes aesthetically pleasing glass okay let's get into it quick and easy guys this takes me no time to make no time to make so let's get into it all right so got my you know my cup my blending cup now maybe i should give y'all measurements well no not really because you know what y'all fix y'all stuff how y'all fix it you know because i may only do a certain amount of cream or a certain amount of coffee a certain amount of camera so you know just however measurements you want to use okay so for me i always like shaking everything up i that's just i don't know why i do that i just do don't worry about it i just do okay so my salted caramel creamer is ready my coffee i'm gonna put my coffee in there now if you know anything about um, espresso coffee, you know it's a strong, this particular coffee and espresso coffee, it's a stronger style coffee. So you don't need a lot of it because it's very strong. So, all right, we're going to put about that much coffee in there. That's what I'm doing. About that much cup uh, coffee in there. I'm going to do a little bit more, a little bit more. It's a strong coffee. So, all right, so I'm going to do that. Now, my creamer. Put my creamer in there. Let me do it so that people can see. All right, so I got my coffee in there. Got my creamer in there. I like a lot of creamer. Hey, this is my video. I'm just showing y'all how I make my frappe. Make your frappe however you wanna make it. Now I'm just, don't go there. Anyway, all right, so we got that in there. Got my creamer in there. I'm gonna put all four ice cubes in here. All four of them. All four. You don't need a lot of ice cubes. Four is enough. All right. So let's get our top on here. Easy. Uh, duh, girl, girl. Caramel frappe, girl. Put the caramel in there. It's 
sorry about that y'all all right i'm gonna pour my caramel syrup in there yes yes i like a lot of caramel anyway it's a caramel frappe duh you're gonna need your caramel all right so we got our top on got our top on looking good just look like a regular iced coffee you could do it this way too regular iced coffee but let's go ahead and get it on get that all blends it up now you want to make sure you want to make sure all your ice get blended okay it don't take that long it don't take that long you can tell your ice is all blended up let me get my top on this creamer like i said guys you y'all see how quick and easy i did that it, it doesn't take much it don't take much for the frappe i didn't want to do whipped cream because when i used to add the whipped cream to mine it just made it too sweet you know i'm not trying to make it too sweet it's enough sweetener with the caramel syrup and the uh, salted caramel creamer. You know, it's sweet enough for me. Of course, you can put your whipped cream in anything else you want to put on top. It don't matter. But I just choose not to because this is sweet enough. So, as you guys can see, I am going to zoom you guys in. I'm going to zoom you guys into the glass. Yes. I'm trying to make it as a Aesthetically pleasing as I can guys I'm trying and still trying to show you guys how I make it at the same time so all right so let's pour it in got a little shadow going there Ooh. I'm gonna zoom you guys into that Ooh, and like I said, you can put your whipped cream and anything else you want on there. Hey, this that, that's your stuff. Do what you want to with it. I'm just showing y'all how I fix my caramel frappe. Look at that. Now, I do have some chocolate. Let me show you guys. I do have the Garadelle chocolate syrup. I do have that too. And I normally, let me just show y'all what I do since this is my frappe. I normally just put some across the top. Come on, chocolate. Y'all know that Ghirardelli is thick. Ugh, ugh. All right. I just put it across the top like that. <laughs> Starbucks where? <laughs> nah, boo. We don't do Starbucks. Uh, McDonald's Cafe where? Yes. Yes. And I did that in like two seconds. Two seconds. And that's it guys that is it for my updated how i make my mcdonald's slash starbucks caramel frappe at home quick and easy guys quick and easy thank you guys so much for your love and support over the years guys don't forget to go in the description box that is the link to my second channel over there is my christian journey that is my spiritual journey channel yes i am a child of god child of the king um if you guys would like to join my spiritual journey over there come over there and join me guys i, I share things that i go through living for god living for christ things that i've been through my life guys just if you're interested in that click on the link in the description box guys once again this is arika misha thanks guys bye